every action has either positive or negative impact on the system. For this reason, impact analysis are important to test the solution before implementing it. Impact analysis helps to give an overall view of what may happen in each domain and its cost in order to implement, modify, or alternate the proposed action or solution. You may apply impact analysis through the following steps. First, define the situation clearly. A clear definition of the situation will help to determine which domains will be affected by the solution. Identify the objectives. It is important that the problem-solving team understand the cause of the assessment, which will help to select the most suitable solution. These can include project cost, development schedule, risks of the project or domain, and functional requirements. Identify the areas of impact. Identify the related domains to the situation and the potential areas where the solution will affect. Gather information. Collect relevant information from all aspects, team members, stakeholders, frontline workers, and management. It's important to collect as much data as possible, which will help to have a clear vision of the situation. Evaluate the outcomes. In this step, you will evaluate the pro and con of the proposed solution and its impact on each aspect of the system. Finally, select the optimum solution. In the end of this process, summarize the outcomes and identify the optimum solution. Beware that if a solution meets all project required objectives, but also increases development costs, blows the schedule beyond acceptable limits, and introduces new risks, it might not be the one with the least or most favorable impact. You may apply impact analysis through this table. First, you identify the business area or system. Then write down the potential impact. After that, determine if it's a positive or negative impact. After that, define what makes the impact positive or negative. Then determine the magnitude. And finally, write down the source for additional information. You can also analyze multiple areas of impact through the following table. You can determine if the impact on business area or system and the impact on project development and implementation and user impact also, you can determine other issues or considerations. Finally, determine the overall impact and who to contact for additional information.